Hi, my name is Stephen Brown, and I'm one of the judges on TLC's Craft Wars. And today, I'm going to show you how to make a mini party hat place card holder. Now, in Glitterville, I have always made party hats. And one of the things that really escaped me was, how do I know what size circle to cut to end up with a party hat that I actually want that size? Now, today, these party hats are going to be three inches. The formula is actually really easy. Just double it. So if I want it to be three inches tall, cut a circle that it's approximately double that. So I found the lid of a craft jar that's approximately six inches, and I'm just going to trace around it. Then, with a pair of scissors, I'm just going to cut that out. Now, a standard size party hat is usually about nine inches tall. So for that, I would use a piece of poster board and cut a circle that was 18 inches. Once you've cut the circle out, fold it in the middle, crease it, and then cut it in half. Now this one circle will make two place card holders. Half a circle, put a little bit of hot glue on one side, and simply fold it up. Now one of the things about party hats is you can make them really tall and slender or a little wider at the bottom. Now at Glitterville, people are always calling or writing us emails about what is the best way to apply glitter. They always think there's some magic answer, but actually it's just tacky glue. Good old white tacky glue. And it's easy. Just brush on an even coat, not too thin, and I don't even water it down. Just brush it on so the glitter really gets deep inside of it. And the best thing on this is don't get too far ahead of yourself. Like don't brush the entire hat before you start putting on the glitter because sometimes it gets a little bit too dry. So I'll just do one side and then I'll sprinkle it using a spoon. And once you've done this process over the entire thing, you can speed up drying time with a hair dryer or let it dry naturally. Now these are for a party at TLC, and I've got a lot more to make. But when they're completely dry, I'll finish off the bottom with a little bit of a pipe cleaner. And if you want that fun party hat tassel at the top, you could also put a piece of pipe cleaner there. For even more tips and techniques, go to craftwars at tlc.com.